telling you, this video is super helpful. Yeah. Hopefully I didn't break something while I was doing that. Hey, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we've got something awesome. We got new truck parts, which is always a wonderful thing. Uh, these are for our Ford Super Duty back there. It is a 2022. And the fine folks at Boost Auto Parts sent us these tow mirror lights to try out. And my dealings with those guys so far have been awesome. Their communication is top notch. And from everything I've read, their products are top notch. So let's get these things out of the box. Let's check them out. Then let's install them on the truck and we will find out. Uh, I did choose the smoked colored lenses and it is the switchback with sequential turn signals uh, so they're going to look pretty sweet. Right. Nicely packaged. Pops right out of there. Looks pretty simple. Uh, if you're interested in replacing the lights like we're about to do, I'm going to leave a link down below to the product that I'm going to use. Also in the description, I'm going to leave a link to the install video, which I have to say, these guys go above and beyond. Uh, they have extremely professional videos on their website. And uh, I'm actually looking at one right now uh, to learn how to install this thing. Okay, the first part of this is going to be a little sketchy, in my opinion. We have to take both of these mirrors out, and I really don't want to break them. But this top one, I believe we bend out like this, and then you pry on it to pop this part off. Guys, you make it look so easy. I'm going to rewind it. I'm going to watch them again. I'm telling you, this video is super helpful. Okay, that looked easy. Here we go. Try again. Oh, got it. Come on. There we go. All right. Then you need to pull these two connectors off. Oh, there we go. All right. Got a little more room now. You can kind of see what I'm doing. There we go. I just needed a light. There we go. There we go. Getting somewhere. There we go. All right. You just got to apply a little more pressure. Uh, it is kind of freaky. They say to extend your mirror. Uh, I've got to do it manually. There we go. Seven millimeter bolts in here. Got to take those out. Yeah. All right, sorry about that. Uh, as I was taking that apart, my wife walked in, caught me putting on new truck parts. I had to explain, I didn't pay for these, you know? Boost Auto sent these over, and she was very appreciative of that. I also had time to grab a magnet, and that is just gonna help me get these screws out without dropping those on the floor in my shop. All right, so we have two more. So now we're gonna take our trim tool, which this piece is uh, coming loose pretty easily. Oh, don't scratch it up, man. Woo, that sucks. I don't like those noises. All right, pause, gotta watch the video again. Oh crap, I was supposed to put... I got a little carried away there. I was trying to take the bottom cap off. Really, you gotta take the top cap off. And you use a flathead screwdriver to pull that down, then push that piece in. The cap pops off. We got the cap out. Hopefully, I didn't break something while I was doing that. And there's the light hanging there. Eh, let's see. All right, so on the bottom of the light, we have this connector. And I believe we. Pull that up and pull the connector out. So that's the factory light. And now we're gonna start putting everything back together. Hopefully I didn't break any clips, but that came out. That's that's pretty easy once you know how to do it. So 
So I'm going to reconnect the switch and that sets down nicely right in place. Just need to align everything on this side and that side. Yeah, that's on great. Now that I've got that part on, I need to put the screws in. But I really want to pull this clear plastic off. Because I just like to. Oh yeah. Very nice. Black with white stripes going on the outside. Cool. Just need to clean everything up and get the other side replaced. And then we'll take a look at it. Install complete. I'm going to remote start the truck uh, just to see the startup process. I want to see what it does. I'm um, going to do that from the remote app or the Ford app, whatever it's called. Here we go. Oh yeah, that's sweet. Turn signal. Oh yeah, that's cool man, I like that. Alright, final thoughts. Uh, fit and finish was absolutely perfect. These lights match the factory lights to a T. Uh, all the fittings, you know, all the bolt holes, everything lined up great. They look great. Sequential uh, turn, I want to say sequential shift, I, I guess I really want a rally car. Uh, the sequential turn signals are really cool looking and I, I really like the running lights. Yeah, overall, I'm, I'm really impressed. Go check these guys out. They carry parts for all, all kinds of makes and models of trucks, not just Fords. Thank you for watching. If it's your first time, please be sure to subscribe to the channel. We're going to have a lot more stuff coming up for you. We've got camping videos and we got truck videos and uh, anything else we can throw in there. So I appreciate you watching and we'll catch you next time. <laughs>